Right, this morning in MongoDB, we're going to learn how to <clears throat> decrement a field or decrease the value of a field. And in the, the previous lesson, we learned how to increase value. Now we're going to learn how to decrease. And you'll note that it's actually very similar uh, to what we did. The difference is we're going to just apply uh, a negative mathematical operator um, to the pretty much the exact same function. So we have these uh, values in our... Um, collection halves, these documents, and you'll notice what we're going to do is, that, first of all, you'll notice that day so far does not match best streak. So what we want to do is we want to decrease the value of best streak across the board. Okay. So like the in the previous video, what we're going to do is we're going to do db.habs.update, and then we're first of all going to specify what we're looking at. So we're going to say best streak, and we're looking at all of the documents. So we're going to say greater than zero since all of them are greater than zero. And then we're going to actually do our increase here. Oops. I'm sorry, our decrease here, I should say. But it looks like we're going to be increasing. So what we're going to do is we're going to say best streak, and then we're going to say negative one. So one plus negative one is zero. It's really one minus one. And then, of course, we're going to specify multi equals true. This is so that it applies across the board to the documents. Okay, so let's look at this uh, before we pass it in. So we're going to specify the best street greater than zero. This uh, Everything is greater than zero. That's why this where clause makes it everything greater than zero. Then we're going to increment the field, but we're going to do negative one. So if I want to decrease it by five, I would make this negative one, negative five. If I want to decrease it by 10, I would make this negative one, negative 10. And then I'm going to specify multi equals true. And the reason why is because it will apply to um, all of the, the documents. And we'll notice that our best streak now matches our uh, days so far. Okay, so if we wanted to just decrease one, we would specify that in our, our where clause. Uh, since this is what I'm saying is a where clause. In the update, it's the very first part, um, the very first up bracket. Items. And then, of course, we would decrease it accordingly, and we would not specify multi to be true. So again, it's very, very similar to increment, and in fact, it uses the increment operator. The difference is we're just passing in the a negative mathematical uh, numeric value so that it knows to decrease the negative will decrease the value accordingly. 